Number 55. Which of the following practices reduces the risk of dispensing errors in the pharmacy? A. Storing LASA drugs near each other. B. Avoiding tall man lettering. C. Ignoring NDC numbers. Or D. Staying focused on the task at hand. And the answer is D. Staying focused on the task at hand reduces the risk of dispensing errors in the pharmacy. Dispensing errors can be reduced by staying focused on the task at hand, minimizing distractions and interruptions, keeping the work area organized, and maintaining good workflow, storing LASA drugs, that stands for look-alike, sound-alike drugs, away from each other, um, by using tall man lettering. This is capital letters used for the similar parts of a drug, drug names. For example, hydroxazine and hydralazine. Those drugs are only different by three letters. So the letters that, that distinguish them are, are made capital. For hydroxazine, the OXY is in capital letters. And for hydralazine, the ALA would be in capital letters. Um, and another way dispensing errors can be reduced is by matching NDC um, numbers of the a prescription order and the stock bottle to assure correct drug is retrieved. Remember the middle numbers of the NDC indicate the drug strength and dosage form. So that's just another extra check. Thanks for watching. For more practice test questions, click below to see my full length PTCB Pharmacy Technician Certification Exam practice test that includes 90 questions with explained answers. And if you find this video useful, please like and share it with others who may find it helpful too. Subscribe to see more of my pharmacy learning videos. And if you'd like to support this channel with a donation, press the heart thanks button to give me a super thanks. Thanks, I really appreciate it.